Oh. One Piece, set seven is here. It's in my hands. One case, I'm just stripping one case. We're gonna do half this week and half next week. Searching for the Boa Manga Rare. I wore my Manga Rare shirt. It's even, it's in Japanese. It's got the Japanese on it, if you can see, because we're looking for a Japanese Boa uh, Manga Rare. So let's strip them. It's set seven, six boxes of set seven. And they're blue and yellow boxes, which is my favorite two colors. And I love Egghead, so very hyped. There's Egghead stuff in here. I'm definitely playing Dr. Vegapunk. I don't know. I say that, but I'll probably just end up playing uh, Red Luffy, Starter Luffy. Oh, but before we get going, of course, a message from our sponsor, Kaizoku Cards. Manga Great Eruptions should now be available on the site. I've had a little trouble printing them. They got a little tricky, but 1819 have been making some really cool art together. So, manga great eruptions, check them out. And then we've got a bunch of other really cool stuff coming up. We got a dragon, full art. Uh, this Yamato is pretty sick. Eternal Yamato for OP6. Bonnie eating pizza. And this Bonnie that I've been working on with Biocam. Her art's awesome. Check her out. So, a bunch of cool stuff coming. Oh, yeah. And of course, this Dr. Vegapunk. Uh, should be releasing. I think this is coming out on April 8th, but there will be a pre-release. Follow the Kaizoku Cards Instagram page to learn more, to know when stuff's gonna come out. Um, so they went back to the, uh, bless them. They went back to the style of um, uh, the alt art leaders from like set four, I think it was. Ooh, look at that Frankie. I think this Frankie's really good. Trigger play him or something. And I'm pretty sure there's an alt art of that Frankie which I think looks fire. I'm really excited about the art in this set. Uh, it all just looks really good. It's a really good looking set. Very pretty, very cool stuff in here. This looks like an alt art in here. Oh, Sabo Secret Rare, this looks sick. Wow, this art is insane. I think this is the regular art too. I don't think this is even the alt art. Whew. I think you KO two things when you play this guy. That's crazy. That's a crazy good looking card. Holy hexagon. So I think I, I think that's it in the box. In Japanese boxes, it's just like one, you could just get like a secret rare. Oh, Bonnie, SR. SR. I was watching some guy open shrimp and being packs on from like Singapore. Whenever he get an SR, he'd say SR. I like that. I don't say it myself too much, but wow. Japanese packs, they're so much thinner. Thinner to shrimp them. Um, yeah, so I think, I don't know what, everything in this set looks fun. I think they've been doing a good job of at least, you know, though the meta shifts and it has been kind of triangly lately, I think each set makes new stuff playable at least, which is good. Oh, I think this is the Dawn. Yeah. The Warlords of the Sea. Warlords is kind of a theme. Warlords and Egghead seems to be the vibe of this set. Um, and of course, the manga rare, this Boa manga rare, if you didn't already know, if you haven't heard me already talking about it. I have not pulled a Japanese manga in quite some time. Dang, that's fire. I wish he got an alt art. I don't think he did get an alt art, but Afro Luffy needs an alt art for sure. Um, Chopamon. I think those are, he's a foxy pirate type also. Foxy pi I heard foxy pirates is kind of, kind of nuts. The, uh, the Foxy Leader alt art, that dude be packing. If we pull one, we'll talk about it. I think Luchi also has a leader in this set. And Dragon, Dragon looks sick. He's straight up Luffy's dad, because he's Luffy's dad, apparently, so we think, so we've heard. And um, his skill is basically starter Luffy, but Luffy's dad. You can take two Dawn that are attached to a character and attached to another character. This is kind of nuts. Kind of wild. I think that's a really strong card as well. The cards are getting strong. It's happening. We're seeing more value for less energy. And I think, yeah, I think that that secret was the only hit in this box. But I'm stripping this whole dang thing because I need cards to play. So probably going to get my play set of stuff from opening this case. And we just got one case. I'm just moving to doing one case of Japanese stuff. On to the next box. That's one box in already. Oh man, so hype. And set six is about to come out in English. I think by the time the second video of this comes out, 
because actually today, the day that is actually today is uh, Wednesday. I'm recording on a Wednesday. And the Dragon Ball Fusion Worlds case opening came out today that I did. So if you saw that, thanks for watching. Bless them. Thanks for checking out the Dragon Ball Shrip'em. Dragon Ball Fusion Worlds is looking pretty good. It's looking like a pretty hot game. Um, I had a lot of fun playing it at the pre-release, but I have not played it since. And I honestly don't get that much time to play card games these days. But I am working on a pretty crazy product at Kaizoku Cards. It's a manga deck, which maybe I'll show it off at the end of this video. But it is a full, fully manga out version of the deck that I played at Nats. It's built to beat Sakazuki, and it can still hang in OP6. I've tested it against some OP6 stuff. It's, it's definitely playable. The deck can clap. It's a real uh, punch you in the face, then punch you a little bit harder, then punch you... Ooh! That'll punch me in the heart. Hankoku Swan. Wow. What a beautiful alt art. Definitely one of the alt arts I did want to pull from this set. So very happy to have that. And this is what the manga rare is of this card also. So very hype. I think with an alt art, you can still get an alt art leader in a box. I believe. And maybe I think there's SPs in this set also. I don't know. I think there's an Izo SP. That that card looks really cool. Maybe a Dofi SP also. The alt art of this looks insane. I would love to pull that. That's a sick looking card. I think I think of all the sets that have come up, like I've got a lot of hype around this one. I mean, it's from 500 years in the is it in the 500 years in the future or 500 years in the past? Egghead is the island that's supposed to be 500 years in the future, so I think it is 500 years in the future. But there are mysteries 500 years in the past Dawn! that, uh, you know, we all want to know the mysteries. If you all are caught up with the manga, oh man, the last chapter. So I'm, I'm recording this. This is almost the last day of February, but last week's chapter, whew, Vegapunk on his last breath. Oh man, I don't want to spoil. I don't want to spoil too much. Sorry, maybe I spoiled everything by saying that. But the anime has been pretty good. I'm like an episode behind. I think the last episode I saw law just turned into lady law speaking of lady law i got a pretty cool lady law card coming up at kaizo cards this one this uh red purple law i'm also going to make the purple law blocker manga proxies so look forward to that if you like playing purple i like playing i like playing purple luffy when fresky b and i play she plays an l and i just can't beat her with anything purple luffy i at least stand a chance i beat her once with purple luffy but the red luffy deck red luffy can get an l it can, and it can get Sakazuki also. You just gotta see Whitebeard and win. Stussy, nice, CP9. I'm imagining that goes in the Robolucci deck, which, you know, I would say I wanna play everything. And then, I, I do think I will build Vegapunk though, because yellow is just, yellow has too many tools. And a two life leader, living on a ledge, like you know, if they're, if they're going to give a leader two life, if they're going to say, okay, this leader can only have two life, you know that leader's going to be insane, right? Bless him. That's like, there's no way that a leader is not just going to be fully cracked. If it only has two life, they're saying this guy's so crazy that you only get two. Wait, we need to look at that card again. That was the, that was the, the vampire Luffy or zombie Luffy. Whew. Look at that art. That should have gotten an alt art. That would have been a sick alt art. Alas, they picked Frankie. Well, who deserves it? Oh, Nami SP. This is the banished Nami. This is Onami. Wow, what a beautiful card. That's a great SP to pull. Look at look at that exciting texture on there. It's just glowing and popping and such so much fun. Can you get a, a focus of that? Wow. What a crazy looking card. Sick. And that means there's still going to be another hit in here. Because that's not... that's that, I mean, that is a big hit, but that's not the biggest one. And I think you only get one of those per case in the Japanese cases. English, you get two SPs in a case. And I wonder if they're going to do the same thing where in the SP box, he's like the leader box. Set 5 is all mapped all weird. And I also believe in these Japanese boxes that you can get... Um, a god pack. I think there are alt leader god, god packs. I think that somebody, I saw a video of somebody pulling a pack that had all the alt leaders in it, which is wild. That's very, that's a very good pack to pull. 
I haven't pulled any crazy Japanese stuff. Really, set one, I, I pulled the, the most heat because I opened, like, an absurd amount of Japanese set one. But, you know, weaning down to one case per set of Japanese. Definitely do more English. But I just, I play the English cards. That's ace. Wow. Sick. I think that's probably the only hit in the box after that. I would guess. I'm assuming. And these Japanese bot. Oh, this this Hawkins card is really good. It's like if that card's removed, you just kill one of your opponent's cards. What a what a well flavored card. It's totally totally Hawkins flavor. Yeah, I don't think that there's going to be another big hit in here. I think it's just you get the SP and we got a secret. So that's one ace and one sabo so far. And I, I really love those arts. I mean, those are like alt art level. They got to alt art level with the regular secrets. That's crazy. Kind of, kind of crazy. Nice stuff. I like these packs also. I like blue and yellow are my favorite colors. And the set's kind of blue and yellow, like blue and yellow. So I'm very happy about it. You know, I keep thinking with like each set, I'm like, how are they going to top this? How are they gonna get better than this? And guess what? They do it again and again and again. I'm keeping that one sealed. I want one sealed pack of this set. So that's my sealed pack. I don't think that that is gonna have anything crazy in it. All right, three boxes in. We got some really hot heat already. But what else? Still haven't seen a leader yet. And we got one, there was one alt art and two secrets. So. There should still be two more secret boxes, bless them, in this case total. But what will it be is the question. There's so many good things. There's so many, I think like every, I just want to pull different stuff. That's my only request. That's the same as I say that. Um, but I think there could still be a leader in here. Maybe, possibly, potentially. Yeah, so I made a full manga version of the deck that I played at NAS. And the product I'm releasing, it's it's gonna be, oh wow, this SR looks sick. This is like the Egghead style art also. Oh man, that's a cool card. I love this. This might be my favorite SR ever. And the card's really good. It's insane. I think you just, you KO it, KO something. Draw a card or something like that. Really good, free, free play from life. I'm telling you, Vegapunk's gonna be wild. I cannot wait to play that man. Yeah, they said this leader, this leader only gets two life because he's on crack cocaine. That's how insane he is. Um, whoops, there's a leader. Dragon, Luffy's dad. Yeah, I like my art better. Gotta say, sorry, sorry about that. Um, I would love to pull more of those Luffy SRs. Didn't need a place out of that because I want to play Vegapunk for sure. But yeah, so the uh, the manga deck is it's the only time I've ever done a product like that. I don't I don't imagine I will do another thing like that where it's you know it's a full deck comes in sleeves. It comes with a limited leader that there's only going to be ten of. They're serialized to ten, so there's only going to be ten of these decks. They come in a deck box with uh, with like a card on the deck box and a pin in the deck box. They look pretty sick. I got them all right up there. I'm just waiting for the sleeves to come in. As soon as the sleeves come in, I'm gonna sleeve up the decks and post them. I offered it to my 10 most appreciated customers from Kaizoku Cards first. I emailed them all. If you were in the top 10 of my Kaizoku Cards customers, thank you for your support in my Kaizoku Cards mission. And it is my honor to offer you first dibs on the deck. Um, if you haven't messaged me back yet about that, for those of you that have, thank you. For those of you that haven't, I have not locked it in for you. So there will be a couple available and they're probably going to be posting actually probably right around when I post this video. It really just depends on when the sleeves come in. Shrip them. All right. So we got a secret rare Sabo. That's three secrets down. That means that there's only going to be one more secret in this one. And that means next week video is going to be way more hype because it's not going to be many secrets one maximum depending on if we pull one here but it's just two more boxes to shrip them of 500 years in the future because we are on an island 500 years in the future it's a great time to start watching one piece i don't know if you have started yet bless them but even if you just jump in now it's really good the story's really good i'm assuming if you're watching this video you probably 
watch or read. I recommend doing both. I think they're both very worthwhile. I, I did start with reading it because it was just a lot to digest. So I read it and then I watched it and it was cool from reading it first and then watching it because when I read it, I kind of like made up the characters voices and things in my head and then when you watch it it kind of fills out all the space you know there's like the music and the characters voices and their little moo oh, another boa okay if, if there's any alt that i was going to pull two of this is it so i'm i'm cool with that well the manga would have been sick but two boas pretty nice pretty pretty nice and there could still be an alt art leader in here i believe we still haven't come up on an alt art leader yet and we're almost halfway in so somewhat repetitive case so far, but of the cards to pull, Boa is the one to pull. But it is kind of a bummer in Japanese cases because you just don't get that many alt arts. So, right, I just, I just opened two out of, I think there's only eight total. So that means that I'm only gonna see a maximum of six. I don't think there's gonna be any more than that different. So that's kind of a little bit of a bummer. But what if there was a god pack in here? What if there's a god leader pack? Oh my god, though. Wouldn't that be sick? All right, we're almost at the end of this box. I would love to pull another one of those Luffy's. Where's that Luffy? Luffy SR. I'd be happy to see another one of those guys. What an absolutely sick looking card so dang cute but when english comes out i'm definitely going to be stripping a bunch of english i also want to try bonnie i think bonnie looks like a fun leader green's green's a little better than it was once upon a time and is this an alt leader in here nope it's a nothing it's a not a thing all right one last box for this video and then we'll be halfway through the case thanks for sticking around for this strip them i'll definitely i'll bust out the manga deck so you can check it out after these packs of one p of the one piece card game the game that i love to strip them so much bless them there's no game that i like stripping more than the one piece card game i can say that confidently with full confidence the art is just so diverse oh oh robrucci robert luch what a guy he's got his gang behind him cp9 he's looking real thick Shows up on Egghead and says, hey, what's up? Kind of, that's kind of what he does. But there still should be an alt art in here, I think. I think in packs, I think in boxes where you get an alt leader, you still get an alt art, I believe. Which is nice, last box, hype last box. It's gotta be in one of these packs, here it is. Oh, Frankie! Wow, looking real tough. Looking real tough, Frank. Let's open the Blossom. What's in the Blossom here? Uh, that's our nice. I want to get another one of those Luffy's though. Where's that dang Loof? Come on, buddy. That was a. That seems like a pretty rare SR. We've only pulled one so far, and we're already halfway into a case. That's wild. Absolutely wild. But oh, the regular art boa. I actually like this art a lot, also. Dang, what a beautiful card. Another SR. One more SR. Make it a Luffy. Come on, Mugiwara. Mugiwara! Give it up for Egghead. Ooh, this isn't an SR. Get, well, come on, let's get a round of applause and a big give it up for Egghead Luffy. Not, that's a different Luffy card. Not the Luffy I was looking for. All right, everybody, let's, let's give it up a big round of applause. That actually might be all the other may not be another SR in here. <laughs> Whoops. Man, where's that egghead Luffy? What the heck? What the heck and how? Maybe not. Maybe not, but we gotta strip him. We gotta check to see where the heck egghead not egghead Luffy. Oh well. Alright, well, that's it for this week. Thanks for coming by and checking out the strip em. Um, I did say I would show off the manga deck, so I'm going to show you guys how cool that is right now. Let me just reach up and grab one. Hiya! So here it is. This is 
the manga deck joku dmd x hz19 kaizoku cards manga deck it comes in this sick deck box what you get with this product is a dawn deck with a new style dawn of luffy's first manga panel got some cool texture on there get 10 of these and they have a limited back limited manga deck kaizoku cards it's got that special back on the dawn serialized leader there's only 10 of these puppies and then a full manga deck which i did a live a, a uh, instagram live so if you want to see me go through the whole deck i go through it on that but this is the deck you get the gold luffy only available in the manga deck the regular luffy is available on kaizoku cards but all these cards are also available on kaizoku cards if you just want to build up the deck you can do that as well anyway i'm a dentist I can't end without a dental tooth tip my dental tooth tip to you would be you know i've said this a couple times but really consider straightening your teeth if you haven't there's not just aesthetic benefits, but there's also functional benefits of having your teeth aligned. They're easier to clean. It's easier to maintain the spaces between them. It's easier to have a, a bite that doesn't set things out of whack. And once you do straighten them, you wanna make sure you keep them straight. So wear your retainer and make sure you wear that every night if you can, at least a couple nights a week. Keep it clean, visit your dentist, make sure that you're doing the things that you need to do. It's worth it because your teeth are valuable as heck and it sucks to find out when you have to pay for them. Better just take care of them first. See y'all next week.